happened in the parking lot and tonight both officials from the mosque and investigators say it all stemmed from an ongoing dispute between two of the male worshipers here. Tonight we're learning one of the major questions they're asking the suspected shooter is whether or not he was acting in self-defense. Chaos breaks out at a Tampa mosque after at least two shots were fired in a crowded parking lot around midnight. The person involved in the shooting who the deputy initially came in contact with is cooperating with detectives. That HCSO deputy quick to respond. He had just finished working security at the mosque. Several hundred worshipers were also there, Ramadan being the holiest time in the Muslim religion. From preliminary information, we understand that the, the shooter and the victim do know each other. To some degree, an argument did ensue and shots were fired at some point. The gunshot victim pronounced dead at Tampa General Hospital. In a statement posted to their Facebook page, the Islamic Society of Tampa Bay says it's unclear what the altercation was about, but noted the shooter has a concealed weapons permit. It also makes clear the shooting is not a hate crime. A spokesperson also tells Fox 13 this was unrelated to the mosque, to Ramadan, the prayer services, or mosque security. There is no terrorist overtones to this at all. Ala Bashish says he was close with the gunshot victim, telling us he'd lived in the U.S. for about a decade and had recently earned citizenship. He's angry, claiming the suspected shooter was carrying his gun in coordination with the mosque as a way to protect worshipers. Why would you shoot an unarmed man in a spiritual establishment? Why would you shoot a man and there is a police a few feet away? Now, deputies are still quest questioning the shooter, uh, saying at this point no charges have been filed. Now, we did just speak with a representative uh, from the Islamic Society of Tampa Bay. He addressed the shooting, calling it tragic, saying it could have happened anywhere, but it just happened to happen here. Here's more from that spokesperson. This is a, a, uh, a place of worship. This is not a shooting range. And just as you would be shocked if a shooting happened in the church, uh, we're shocked that a shooting happened here at the mosque. I mean, the house of worship is a place that you go for refuge, for worship, to get closer to God, and it should be a safe haven from violence. So it's very unfortunate an incident took place. Again, we're trying to make sense of it. Now, he also said while some members may have their own concealed weapons permit, he says the mosque doesn't have any sort of plainclothes, secret armed security that works there.